Good morning, New York. Day one of softball for playoffs in Section 7 featured some great action, including a great matchup in the circle between Beekman Town as they were trying to play spoiler as a number six seed. The three seed Chiefs were looking to get to the semifinals after not making it there last year. We'll take it bottom of the five, Jaina Rousset, making this one interesting. Her RBI single gives the Eagles a two to one lead. Same inning though, Saranac's defense Looking to make potential top play nominees. They're trying to stay close. with the Benjamin nice grab right there. So we're taking to the bottom of the day. 2-2, free softball in Saranac. OB sees the pass ball. She's going to try to reach home on it. And she's safe. Sighs of relief for Saranac as they move on to the semifinals. Um, I was very excited. I was nervous that it wasn't going to happen. So when it did, I was very happy. Um, as a senior, it means a lot to me to be able to move on. You know, we, we really came together as a team and came out with the W. Definitely. One, two, three, work. Number four, Peru working on joining Saranac in the semis as they host number five, Aus Sable. Bottom of the first, Patriots up, but not for long. Gabby Cunningham hits that grounder up the middle to go through. She's going to score two Nighthawks right there. Same inning, Kylie Lemon. Nothing sour, but all sweet from that swing to left. How about a three RBI triple right there? Would you believe me if I said same inning? Rachel Madow were driving an opposite field for an RBI. It was all of Peru's bats, though, that helped them score 25 runs in this one, meaning they will face the number one seed, Plattsburgh, in the semis. Number two, Saranac Lake, will host Saranac on the opposite side of the bracket. First pitch for both games is set for this Tuesday at 4.30 p.m.